When using containers for seedling production, it is important to ensure the quality of soil substrate to use. Use the resources that are available in the area such as fertile topsoil, well decomposed animal manure, vermipost, river sand and carbonized rice hull. Mix the available materials into proportions that can provide the suitable feature of good substrate. Consider good aeration and water holding capacity. For example, if the topsoil available is too clay, adding river sand, well decomposed manure or carbonized rice hull will make the substrate more porous, hence good aeration for root development and drainage when watering. On the other hand, when topsoil is sandy, adding well decomposed manure will increase the water holding capacity of the soil substrate. It also provides additional nutrient for the growing seedlings. An example of soil substrate ratio used in West Nile is 2 to 1 to 0 0.5. That is, 2 units of topsoil, add 1 unit manure and half a unit of sand. A good soil substrate is free of soil-borne pathogens, weed seeds and insect pests. Do sterilization through heating the mixed soil substrate on pan or exposing to intense sunlight for a day or two.